When we first started with the idea of Futurecraft, it was to sort of guide us, to set us on a path. It's a mindset and it's a philosophy to try things. We're always bringing in new influences, new ideas, new collaborations. 3D printing, for example, was one of these new technologies that really had unlimited possibilities. You know, the initial problem was, okay, can we actually make a running shoe out of 3D printed material that really works and works well. So when we started thinking about doing 3D printing, we wanted to use liquids, because liquids give you the most flexibility in material design. I think of light as a chisel. Light triggers the solidification of the liquid, but oxygen inhibits it. That allows us to have the object grow. What's really interesting about this collaboration with carbon is we're seeing a convergence of a completely new manufacturing technology. We're going to scale it with the best industrial partner in the business. We're able to deliver tens of thousands and moving to hundreds of thousands and into the tens of millions. You know, that's clear in front of us. We have this amazing opportunity to innovate the printing process, the liquid rising. And growing in that context can give you new design thoughts you've never had before and new performance capabilities that wouldn't be possible by traditional manufacturing. This three-dimensional mesh structure, it's a lattice, it's a matrix, it's a web of individual elements. Each one of those little elements is tuned specifically for a purpose. These lattice structures behave quite differently than anything we've dealt with before. They're much different than foams. Now we have every individual area of the shoe to work with, which is a completely new horizon for us and a new venture. If you really want to make a shoe that's a size nine, that same shoe for someone who's 180 pounds versus 100 pounds has got to be different. We can go in within every single cell and engineer that exact cell to do exactly what the consumer needs it to do just for them. That's fascinating. That's going to change uh, how we create products and certainly how consumers experience products. And I think that's how we see something like Futurecraft 4D playing into the life of an athlete. I would say this is just the very beginning and you know, it sounds silly and cliche, but you know, who knows, man? I don't, I, I don't know what's next, and that's what's great about going to work every day.